Imagine playing an amazing video game in the comfort of your own home. As you immerse yourself in the game's world, characters, and deep lore, something sinister is happening beneath the surface. While you're being distracted by the action-packed gameplay, all of your personal information is being siphoned by foreign intelligence without your knowledge or permission. It seems like an excerpt from a spy movie, but would you believe me if I told you that this is a fear that certain individuals actually share? The upcoming dystopian shooter Atomic Heart has recently been the target of such claims based on alleged unclear responses in regards to Russian involvement. The first wave of panic surrounding developer Munfish's first project began on January 16, 2023, where the official Twitter account posted a statement regarding recent inquiries about the company. Essentially, gamers want to know if Russia had any direct involvement in the game's development and funding. Considering Atomic Heart's premise, the player assumes the role of a KGB agent in a timeline where Russian scientists developed an advanced polymer technology that changed the world as we know it. The tweet read, Guys, we have noted the questions surrounding where we at Munfish stand. We want to assure you that Munfish is a developer and studio with a global team focused on an innovative game and is undeniably a pro-peace organization against violence against people. Munfish went on to say, we do not comment on politics or religion. Rest assured, we are a global team focused on getting Atomic Heart into the hands of gamers everywhere. We do not and will not condone contributors or spammers with offensive, hateful, discriminatory, violent, or threatening language or content. Due to the lack of directly addressing any Russian involvement, this sparked outlandish and unfounded claims that any financial support was a direct contribution to Russia's efforts in the ongoing invasion of Ukraine. Additionally, AIN Capital published an article based on a line in the website's privacy policy stating that Munfish collects users' data and may provide it to Russian state authorities. Munfish quickly responded and clarified that our game and website do not collect any information or data. The website's privacy statement is outdated and wrong and should have been removed years ago. We have shut down the shop to assure our fans of the integrity of our studio and products. We apologize for any confusion on the matter. Naturally, content creators and fear mongers alike seized this opportunity to profit off of Munfish's bad press and exacerbated the issue by continuing the spread of misinformation like a wildfire. In the end, the reality is that every decision you make has a consequence. That is simply the way of the world. However, it is up to the individual to make an informed decision. Sadly, in this day and age of social media, the masses refuse to think for themselves and would much rather jump on a bandwagon fueled by fear and ignorance than research the facts and decide for themselves. If it hasn't already been made abundantly clear, it is unacceptable to label an entire group of people, as each group is made up of individual persons with their own values and beliefs. The dark truth that horrifies me most about Atomic Heart is not the false claims it's a spy program disguised as a video game, but the fact that in this age, millions of ignorant people have the power to incite worldwide panic in the palms of their hands. Will you be playing Atomic Heart on February 21st? If so, leave a heart in the comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe for more content like this, and until next time, it's the Inhuman One, signing out.